Hi guys! I know that most of you are having your final exams, so I created this video on how to prepare for your final exams and ace them. I hope you will find this video helpful and also do make sure to subscribe to see more study content like this. Now, without further ado, let's begin. The first tip is to plan. You have to plan how you will study for your exams. This involves knowing what topics will be in the exam, knowing your difficulty for each of the topics, and what kind of study methods will you incorporate to study the topics, and of course, how many days do you have before the exam day. Normally, before starting my finals review, I would make a detailed plan of the list of lessons I will study for each day and how I will study for those lessons. Example, on Monday, I should finish studying Physics Lesson 3.1 and Physics Lesson 3.2 and I will study those lessons by first reviewing my flashcards of those lessons and doing practice exercise 1 and 2. Now, it is important for you to know how difficult each lesson is for you so that you will know if you need at least two to three hours to finish studying it or you may need a day to finish studying it. Now this helps in making sure you are not overloading the task you have to accomplish each day which can also lead to being burned out. My next tip is to know your weakness. It is good to know in which subjects you struggle in so that you know which subject you need to spend more time studying in. Likewise, it is good to know which lessons you struggle in so that you can also give more time studying it compared to other lessons that you are familiar with. Next is to remember your mistakes. It will be nice if you can remember the mistakes that you have made during your review session so that you won't repeat those same mistakes once you take your finals. I noticed that most of the mistakes I make during my exams tend to be the same mistakes I make during my review sessions. So it's like a waste of points knowing that I could have gotten a higher score if I just remembered my mistakes I made during my review sessions. Now, I suggest writing down your mistakes in a notebook and looking through it again before you take your finals so that you will be reminded of your mistakes and most likely, you won't commit the same mistake in your final. Next is past papers. Now, since it's finals, you mostly had previous exams where they test you on the lessons that will be included in the finals. Now, with this, it is best to go over past tests or homeworks so that you can gauge yourself if you are familiar with the lesson or if you need to study it more. Also, by reviewing past papers, you can most likely guess what kind of questions your teacher will give in the final, so this can like give you an edge since you can prepare ahead and be ready in case that question pops up. Also, you can see the mistakes you made in your past exams and this of course helps in remembering your mistakes so that you won't make the same mistake in your final. Next is cram. Now, only use this in the event that you have little time to study for your exams due to your exams being scheduled back to back or you procrastinated on studying and now you have about less than 24 hours before your final begins. Now, the key to cramming is to not to study all the lessons in the little time you have left, but to study your weakest lessons in the little time you have left. This is because you don't have enough time to go over the lessons you are familiar with. And of course, since you are familiar with those lessons, you most likely won't get any question related to those lessons wrong compared to questions involving the lessons you are weak in. Now with this method, you won't necessarily get like a high grade in your final, but sometimes it can happen. But most of the time, you will most likely pass your final or just like get an average grade for your final. 
Next is review sessions. If a teacher will host a review session, then make sure to attend it. This will help you recall the information you need in your exam as well as the teacher can give hints of what lessons to prioritize or what kind of questions will come out which gives you an edge of course to get a better grade in the final. And most of the time, the teacher during review sessions will teach the lesson in like a better manner. So if you didn't understand the lesson in class, then during the review session, you will most likely understand it better since the teacher will be able to explain it like in a better manner. I don't even know why this happens, but it has happened a lot of times to me and um, I hope that will be helpful. And review sessions also allow you to ask any last questions that you need your teacher to answer before the final exam. And who knows, maybe that question you ask to your teacher may pop up in the exam. Next is to avoid caffeine. Now, on the night before exam day or just generally the day before the exam and the day during the exam, please do not take any substance that contains caffeine. Caffeine makes one too hyper and because of this, one may not be able to focus during the final which can lead to a lower mark in the final. I suggest before your final, just drink some water and make sure you have eaten something so that you have enough energy to power through the final. Last is to write important information. Now, if you are like me, who easily forgets formulas or important information relevant to the final, I suggest using a pencil, write down all the information you know you will forget in like 2 minutes on top of the final or the final or exam paper so that you won't have to be scared of forgetting about it and even wasting time during the final trying to remember what was that information now and now you have your like your own little cheat sheet and you can keep referring back to it during the final now just make sure to erase it after finishing the final since some teachers may not like seeing messy papers and those are all the tips I can give you on how to prepare for your finals. Now, I hope this helps you and good luck to all who will be taking their finals and wish you all the best. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more study content like this. Now, I will see you all in my next video. Bye!